Hi, my name is B, and I'm going to show you all the components to make a parallel circuit. First, I think this is familiar to you. This is a light bulb. This is a light bulb holder. It screws like that. On the edge of the light bulb holder a fun stop clips. There to help attach your wire. Next is a battery, otherwise known as a D cell. This is a battery holder. It also has fun stop clips. These are motors. Sometimes they're seen in electrical erasers. <laughs> and finally, this is a switch. It also has fun stop clips. Now I'm gonna show you how to make a parallel circuit. It's okay, it's okay. First, get your light bulb holder. Then, get your wire. Push the fun stop clip down, and then stick the wire through the clip. Like so. Then, get another wire. Do it the same. Then, get the battery. You see, there are also fun stop clips. Connect the fun stop clips like this. And one on the other end. This makes a circuit. As you can see, the light bulb will light well. This is a circuit. It looks a bit like a circle. That's how I remember it. Now, I'm going to add a motor. A parallel circuit is a circuit that has two pathways. So, as so, I get my motor. I'll put my, my wire into the pump stop clip and the other into the other. Starts to move. Now, if I take this light bulb out, it will still work. See? It is still working. That is because there's another path. It can also work with two motors. I'll show you this. Here is another motor. First, I'll get this one started. The other end. You'll see it always starting to move. Then, I'll do the other one. Now, they're both working. If I take one off, this one still works. And that's how you make a parallel circuit.